The Twin Lakes Athletics Conference was first established in 1968 in order to organize intercollegiate athletics competitions between small, private liberal arts schools in the states of Michigan and Ohio. The conference was founded by a group of athletic directors and faculty members from the participating schools who wanted to create an opportunity for college athletes to compete against each other in a range of sports, including men's swimming. The first season of the conference was held in 1969 with only four participating schools, Miami University of Ohio, Ohio Wesleyan University, University of Michigan Flint and Defiance College. The inaugural men's swimming season was held in 1970 with Miami winning the championship. Subsequent championships were won by Ohio Wesleyan, 1971 and 1974, and Michigan Flint, 1972 and 1973. In the 1970s, the conference experienced a period of rapid growth, with the addition of several new schools, including Kent State University, Eastern Michigan University, and the University of Toledo. This expansion resulted in a larger pool of competitors and a more competitive level of play in all sports, including men's swimming. In the early days of the conference, the Men's Swimming Conference Championship meet was held at the University of Michigan Flint's pool. This remained the single site for the event for the first five years of the conference's existence. In 1975, the championship meet was moved to the University of Toledo, which hosted the event for the next 16 years. The level of competition in the men's swimming event in the TLAC was high throughout the 1970s. The decade was dominated by two Michigan schools, Michigan Flint and Eastern Michigan, who combined to win eight out of ten conference championships. The remaining two championships were won by Ohio Wesleyan and Kent State, who both displayed remarkable depth in their rosters. The conference remains a viable and competitive conference today, with 21 teams competing in a range of sports. Men's swimming remains a popular event in the conference, with the championship meet rotating between several universities in the region. Although the teams and locations have changed over the years, the spirit and enthusiasm for the sport remain strong, and the legacy of the conference's early days lives on.
Much obliged you hopped on board for this snazzy trip through American life in the 1940s and 1950s, all captured through nifty vintage photographs. If this flick's got your motor running, don't be a square. Click on that jolly bucket of bolts to subscribe to the channel for more top drawer content just like this. Thank <laughs> you.